with another video. Now this video we have is just um something a little bit different. Now I actually did get this video idea from Brickitect. Brickitect is actually a Lego channel that shows their Lego co Lego collecting journey every single day, every day I should say. And let's just say they're actually really great. YouTubers to be honest with you they have 20,000 subscribers and they're actually really growing uh, whenever I started I think there were like 15,000 subscribers and in like maybe two three months they just gained all the way to 20,000 subscribers and um, they're actually a really great channel they're really fun um, you have really great entertainment on their channel um, they do really great Lego videos, so if you guys want to see some really great videos, just laugh every single day and just see something different from my kind of channel and other and everybody else's channels that are in the Lego community, well, then go ahead and check out Brickitect on YouTube, or I'll have their uh, YouTube in the description below. Actually, one of my favorite Lego channels out there, to be honest with you. I did get a Lego set, okay, this is a Lego set that you guys probably be like, why did you get it? Because as you can see by my Lego shop right here, excuse the vacuum, I have nothing but Lego Ninjago sets, okay, I have the Destiny's Bounty up there, the Lightning Jet, the Tiger Widow Island, nothing but Ninjago right there, even though over here I do have the non-Lego Ninjago kind of stuff, but just going to show you the set I did get, but before that, I'm going to show you something else that's related to Lego, but not anything with Ninjago. But this is actually is something that I've been wanting to get for a very long time. My very first blue base plate. Now, I this is like came out like what maybe the beginning of this year, I think. Um, I've been trying to get one of these. I mean, they're everywhere now, but like. I didn't know when was the time to be collecting these and stuff like that and now since I was just thinking like I'm going to need trying to do good kind of stop motions I know you guys are probably saying that my stop motions are really really great but I just want to see a new kind of background for my Lego stop motions now I know a lot of YouTubers who actually do this actually won AL123 Productions he actually does use the Lego uh, blue base plate for his backgrounds I think it's him or I think it's another Lego YouTuber, or yeah, a Lego, another Lego animator who does really great videos. Um, so I did get that kind of blue blue base plate. As you can see, it, it hasn't I haven't opened it up, which I am actually going to open up right in front of you guys. Now the Lego set that I did get is Lego Friends. I know this is pretty weird and stuff like that. I, I can't believe I'm actually holding one of these, but this actually was for a great price at Walmart. Okay. Now, in Brickitect, they do say, well, Greg, um, he's the main of the channel, he does say, don't pay full price for LEGO, which I actually really do love it, because I actually have uh, got some things from LEGO that I haven't paid full price from, of, and while well, most of these are kind of have, um, this is one set that I haven't paid full price of, this is only $24, and it does go for $40, um, which is pretty bizarre, but yeah, it has 289 pieces, for a set that goes for forty dollars, it's really like wow. It does have too many figures. Um, one I did get this is because of it's a Heart Lake Pizzeria. Now, with this set, there might be something with Jay and Nia inside here, so who knows? And I did need that guy's hair piece right there. I don't know if you guys can see it, but I did need his hair piece, and I'll show you who and why I needed it in a little bit. But again, $24 does come with all these kind of good Lego things right here. So yeah, there's some prints that I haven't ever gotten before. Some things that I've been dying to get in my entire life. So I'm just going to open this up and kind of do a little tiny review. Uh, build it and yeah, I'll get back to you later on. Okay, yes, I know I really showed you guys the box, but I'm just going to show you guys just one more time. This is our Heart Lake Pizzeria, uh, set number 413111, has 289 pieces, ages 6 to 12, who cares about that? Here is the back of the box, and as you can see, 
right here in this corner it does come with new kind of pieces new kind of accessories in the cooking ware kind of things you have one of those uh, baking driller kind of thingies um, you have clear a clear glass cup pizza 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 pieces a pizza box right there a pan with some sauce I don't really know a roller um, you do get like about three or four plates inside here, I think it's three, you got some knives and some forks, this uh, thingy, the, where you, I don't know what the hell that is, uh, you got money, you want to get a hundred dollars, you don't get anything else, but you do get some extra pieces, but not extra pieces with the money or with the menu, you only get one menu inside here, which I think is pretty um, bad, honestly, they should have probably go with maybe two menus instead of one but you can just see that you have all the other kind of goes right there um the characters you do get is emma and oliver i have no idea what oliver is inside this i don't know if it's emma's brother emma's friend or anything like that i do know that emma is one of the main girls in lego friends now you do only get one manual inside here which is actually pretty good um, here is the back of the manual right here. You have Emma right there. I think that's Emma. Um, you just got the build. You got all these kind of ads right here. You have Stephanie's kind of build. Um, uh, Andrea's kind of build. Some advertisements for the other kind of Lego sets right there. You got that one and then you got the house. I have no idea what the heck that one is. Um, you got the map of Heart Lake City. I'm pretty sure you got these girls right here. Then you have the set that we I am reviewing for you guys. Then you got the house right there. Then you have those two girls. And then you have the piece count. Now here is Emma right here. She is holding uh, pieces of pizza right here. It's a supreme kind of pizza as you can see. Or cannot see. Um, her torso is pretty good. Her legs. Now this is actually one of my first time getting a Lego Friends, a minifigure as you can see. As I put that on, you can take off the hair, and I'm pretty sure you can take off the head as well. You have the head right there. My, they don't ever even have double sided faces, I'm pretty sure about that. Um, you do get like that little hole up on the hair piece, which is actually pretty fine by me. This is actually a rubber hair piece. I think almost all of the friends of uh, girls dolls have rubber hair pieces. I don't know. This is actually my first time, okay? I actually have no idea. Is there anything back? Nope. Oh my gosh. Just imagine you just seeing that up night. Okay. Now here is Oliver. Oliver. Yeah, that's his name. You do have that green little shirt right there. I think it's like a flannel shirt. Um, some maroon pants or shorts, you do have those maroon shoes, the same thing as hers, but different kind of color as you can see right there. And there is his face printing right there. This is his hair piece, no double sided face, as you can see right there. And one reason why I did want it to get this set is because of the hair piece, and yes, because of the pizza thingy. But the hair piece does go with this kind of minifigure, so I was actually really excited to get. I've been trying to find this dude's mini, this dude's hair piece for a very long time, and now I have found it. A uh, driving pizza thingy that Jay kind of used in season two. Um, it's not the exact thing by this, but you can see you do have some stickers right there. It does have a really great color coding right there, white, green. And red as you can see right there you do have these purple doors and this yellow top which I kind of do wish they kind of change this now that I'm seeing at it in a very different view do get two pizza boxes as you can see very good printing or sticker printing I should actually say because they're both all stickers there's no printings inside here at all you get the same stickers on both sides got some uh, backlights right there. I don't know how in the hell is he steering this bike thingy or motorcycle thingy. I don't really know if it's with his mind or the phone that he has right here. Um, I think it's an iPhone right there. 
Oh, there we go. But it does have some nice little detailings right there. I think he's playing music Then right here we now. have is the pizzeria. Now the front, it looks really beautiful. As you can see, it has some great flowers right there. Some yellow and green flowers. You have these windows that could open up nice and neatly right here. So you could get some fresh air. The door opens up really great too. It has a clear door, has a yellow mat, has these nice little, um, good styles right here. I don't know what you guys actually do call these. Okay, it has like the Mexican kind of colors right there. Um, the base right here, as you can see, is actually um, a light purple. I don't know what kind of purple this is at all. And I did drop something. Oh, I dropped the fork. I mean this knife. My bad. The knife. But we're just going to start up here, work our way to the back. You do have these nice little plants right here. What you see in, on the windows is the same kind of style and detailing right there. You do have another sticker piece right there. And then you have some bowls that has some knives and some forks, which I really do love, honestly. <coughs> here is the fork. As you can see right there, it's a really nice, nice little tiny detail they did put inside this. And here is the knife, as you can see. Kind of looks like a butter knife, but you know, Lego doesn't want to make kids think all crazy. Then you have this um, clear cup, which I actually didn't really see on my camera. Did you guys see that? I don't know if you guys did or not. You do actually get this leaf piece thingy. I don't really want to take it out, but you do get an extra one of these kind of things. I mean, you do have some of those uh, flowers right there. You have these little chairs that you can just fall off of the balcony. Um, go all the way to the back now. You can see there's really nothing there. You can just see on the bottom part right here, you got some pizzas cooking for those Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles right there. Um, you got this thingy. It's like, I don't know what you call this. Um, you do get that one driller I did tell you. Now these, they really do have some nice, nice kind of molding as you can see. Oh, I just love this. Oh, I love this so much. It's really great to be honest with you. These friends sets have really great detailing, really great things. I'm not kidding. You do get a spatula. I think that's a spatula. I'm hoping that's a spatula right there. You do get this really nice pen as you can see. Right there. Have some sauce with mushrooms and those leaf kind of things for like a seasoning. I think, I'm not really a chef, you do get some more um, fork, fork and a knife right there. This is actually a cheese cutter kind of thing, cheese crater kind of thing. I don't know what you really name that, but you do put it on this plate bowl right there. I don't really know, you do have some cheese right there, which is actually a really great detail right there. You do have the sink, you have the stove, and I'm pretty sure this is actually a roller on the box. It did show it as a roller, so I think that's actually pretty cool. It kind of does roll. Um, this, oh, uh, now I see it. Okay, so this is the sauce for the pizza, and it's that, that's right there. It's the dough, and this, all right, <laughs> all right, yeah. You got a little bowl right here that we did see on top that I forgot to show you guys. Um, you do have these kind of pieces right here. I don't know what they are. This is green. Um, I don't know what they are at all. This doesn't have any kind of printing to show you or me what it is. You have this thingy right here. This is, I don't know what it says. I can't read cursive at all, but this is actually really nice detail right here. It's a printed piece, so that's. Like one of the only pieces that is printed in here, and um, there actually is another piece that is printed in here that we will see in a little bit. That is a compartment that you could put this thing right there. Oh, whenever I was building this, I had a really hard time putting that inside. But you got the pizza right there falling off. I'll just get that out of the way. Then you do have that little kind of tile piece, not tile piece, stickered piece, and that is, I think, sauce, salsa, or salad. I don't know what the heck that is. That looks like salad, the 
sticker looks like salad, but then as you can see, it kind of does look like salsa. That is the only money you do get. You do get this menu right here, which is pretty neat. Right there, you got three, two, four. Has really great choices that you could pick out of. That is another printed piece right there, as you can do see. Just take away the money for you guys. Yeah, the total of 95. What the heck did they order? Holy cow. Didn't know pizza could be so expensive. You do get a telephone right there. At least I'm hoping that's a telephone. Yeah, that's a telephone. But yeah, there's really nothing else to be added to this. I mean, what would be actually really cool is that they could probably make this like a really full restaurant to be honest with you. I think that would be really, really awesome. Um, there was actually some others that I've been wanting with like a juice place kind of thing. I don't know what the heck it was called, but it was something that I really did wanted before. But they don't really sell them anymore because it was like two, three years ago. I'm pretty sure. When did Friends ever come out? 2014, right? So we're 2018, four years ago then. That was... I don't know why I just tend to smell it, but the first time getting one of these base plates, like I said, and let's just say it feels so nice, honestly. I do want to get more of these now that I'm looking at it. Very good. I actually do want to get more of these um, so I can use for my stop motion and stuff like that. Um, this is the background that I do use for my stop motions. This board piece right here, you can see it's a different kind of color or shade from a boo, a boo, a blue base plate, as you can see right here, it is turning me blue too. If you guys haven't seen my last video, what I got from Comic Con, I did get a set. This Harry Potter set. I don't know what to do with it, honestly. I don't know if you guys want me to do a live stream or review it or anything like that so if you guys probably want me to do something with this I'll do a live stream on YouTube if you want me to or if you guys just want me to do a live stream on Instagram which I do have Instagram you can follow me at FusionTube I'll put my name somewhere link in the, in the description as well um, don't, go my, go, don't go to my Twitter because I don't really go there a whole lot so just tell me what you guys actually want me to do with this Harry Potter set because I've been debating if I should review it, if I should open it, or something like that. Okay, I've just been debating I, for a very long time now, ever since I've got this. Um, you do get this guy, don't know his name, you do get Dobly right here, and you do get Hetty Potter right there as well. Um, I'm sorry if I don't know that guy's name. I like Harry Potter. I just don't know a whole lot of characters from it, alright? I don't know a whole lot of characters at all. So I think I'm actually going to end this video off right here. So hope you guys like this video. Like and subscribe for more Lego reviews. Lego kind of style motions that might come out really soon, soon, soon. Um, I actually have been thinking of some stop motion kind of ideas. One of them was another Jan Nia goes on a date kind of video stop motion. If you guys do want that, then give this video a like. Um, comment down below what you guys, what you want me to do. And I'll be sure to do it for you guys. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Also, I don't know, but this has actually kind of been what I've been thinking. Do you guys want me to do my reaction of Lego Ninjago Season 9 trailer? If you guys want me to do that, just put it down in the comments below or just like this video. Um, I don't know. If you guys want me to react to that video, react to the trailer, then I will react to it. I'll be put out my thoughts kind of videos and all that kind of stuff. I'll do my thoughts kind of videos for the show and the sets as well. Um, to tell you guys all the kind of sets that I do want from Season 9 and all that kind of stuff. So, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!